Hello everypony, this is Potterpony, and welcome to another blind reaction to Scooter Tricks Abridged Episode Number 12. Okay, let's just get it started and see what they have in store for us this time. And starting the video in 3, 2, 1, go. Well, war-ish. And what is war ish? Are you in a war ish situation right now? Yeah. You declared war ish? What do you mean? <laughs> it's a secret war. I declared war ish. What? Right now, we are the only ones who know about it. Uh. You see, I am expanding our military, training the troops, strengthening our defenses. So, you're preparing for war? No, we are at war. It, it's just a, a secret. I don't think you fully understand what you're... Why are you declaring war? It is necessary. <laughs> no, it isn't. Have you even talked to them? Probably is. With them? Luna, I have two arch nemeses, both flanking me and both in control of empires. War is inevitable. It's only a matter of time. It will either happen now or later. And if we have it now, we stand a chance. Are we even prepared for this? Equestria has been at peace for a thousand years. Not to worry. I am hiring the absolute greatest generals in all of Equestria. Really? Who Wonder are you who? getting? Ugh. The teacher is so annoying. I'll make you know what the heck multiplication is. Really? The academy made so much more sense. Pretend inferiority and encourage his arrogance. Simple. But two times eight? He gads, what, what the hell does that even mean? Hey, I'm gonna go to the park right now. Do you guys wanna come? No. General Bloom, sir. Ah, Lieutenant. Good to see you. Lou, Bell, this is my good friend, Lieutenant Tiara. We went to the academy together. Pleased to meet you, sir. Really? Hi. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, who's your friend there? Oh, this? This is Spooky Spoon, sir. Sup? Spooky Spoon? <laughs> what a peculiar name. Oh, yes. Well, she's a ghost, sir. <laughs> Ghost? Yeah, I'm dead, but, you know, whatever. But how can you be dead? You're standing right in front of me. Oh, well, watch this. Spooky, do the thing. Ah. You cats. You really are a ghost. Yeah, it's kind of cool, but, you know. How did you die? Um, I don't know. I tripped over a branch or something. I don't really remember. Yeah, it's not important. Hey, it's fine. Death happens to all of us. Well... Except for that goddamn Celestia. <laughs> oh, right. General Bloom, sir. I came to give you a message, sir. Yes? You've been requested to go to Cantalot for important business, sir. Egad, Lieutenant. That sounds incredibly important. Why wasn't that the first thing you told us? Sorry, sir. Come on, Spooky. Great blithering diggings. That girl can be so distracted sometimes. Well, let's see what this important business is then, shall we? Okay, this is the greatest thing that has ever happened to us. I don't know. That cupcake was pretty darn good! I like to see those changelings change themselves from being dead mangled corpses. So, uh, we need a plan. We're gonna be fighting hmm. two That'd be a trick. on two fronts. Any ideas? Um, actually, can I go home? But go home? This is the most Yeah, this sounds pretty boring well, to do anyway. From school yet, and Rarity might be worried about me. Oh dear, um, how long was that meeting? About five hours. He guess. It, our siblings must be worried sick about us. Mine aren't. Why not? I had a horrible traumatic experience as a child, where all my family and friends died in a house fire. He guess. that's quite horrid. This was a childhood experience? You still are a child. Well, this happened yesterday. That sounds horrible! <laughs> it's okay. Oh. It made me who I am. Poor orphan Squidaloo. Right. I, let's let's pick this up after school tomorrow then, eh? And, and remember, don't tell any pony about this. We have to seem like ordinary fillies in an ordinary town. We don't want to draw any attention to ourselves. Oh! Is that why they covered up our cutie marks? Exactly. Just some ordinary blank flanks. Oh, that's why you guys don't have cutie marks. Mine were burnt off in the fire. Oh my god, oh, oh my god. Ever, music is on. You hired 
children to command your army? It's brilliant. No pony would suspect it. It's insane. Yes. Lee, brilliant. No pony would expect it. I can't even comprehend how you think this is a good idea. Oh, come on. They're, they're all military prodigies. And besides, have I ever been wrong before? Of course you... Ugh. I hate you. <laughs> Where were you? It's been six hours. That I was worried sick about you. I was just out playing. I'm sorry. Well, tell me next time, okay? Jeez. I don't know what I would do if something would happen to you. Oh, really? Of course. So, how was school? Horrible. Why do I have to go to school anyway? I've already graduated. Yeah, well, you're only eight, and I think that's a bit soon to finish up your education. But the teacher's so strict, and she talks about things beyond my comprehension. Well, I guess it's good that you're going to school then. Ah! Uh. Now, come on, Amberloom. <laughs> I, I only want what's best for you. Tell you what. Why don't you come down and help me sell some apples? And afterward, uh, I'll buy you a treat. What do you say? That sounds like a plan. Excuse me, sir. Yeah, there's no way that could go wrong. Apples? Back! I can't! Apples, they burn me! Great gabs. What was that all about? Oh, that's a doctor. Apples keep them away, you know. I... <coughs> what? Huh. How about that? Students, I have an announcement to make. Today, we will be going to the library! Oh, okay. Okay. Silence! What's under the cloud fortresses? Impenetrable. Running bombs and shells from the sky. You there, orange student. What? Stop mumbling. Sorry. I zoned out there for a second. Zoned out? That is forbidden. Now, class, today. Yeah, she so mustn't have that. Arithmetic. 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 Arith arith what? Student, what is your name? Sweetie Belle. Well, Sweetie Belle, are you an idiot? Uh, uh, no. Then what is your uh, excuse? A little bit, no. Um, my old school didn't teach it. And what school would that be? Um, well, it was the Academy Ordinary of... Phillies, remember? Don't blow it. Uh, oh, uh, I mean... Would you speak uh, up, child? I... Uh, I... Oh, my God, a distraction. Who said that? You there, student. <laughs> How dare you disrupt my class, disrespect me again, and you will die a horrible death. Wait, what? That silence or That students. seems like a really strict teacher. Let's start with a few simple math problems, shall we? Belly pinch! Oh, yeah, um, yes, Miss Charlie. What is six plus two? Oh, jeez. I, uh, you know, uh, what, is it, uh, three? My God, what is wrong with you? Oh, jeez. Uh, what uh, the blue scooloo? What are you doing? Ah, uh, <coughs> just eating a crayon. That is forbidden! Okay, cool. <laughs> Sweetie Bell! Uh, yes, Miss Charlie? Six plus two, what is it? Um, is it eight, Mr. Lee? Berry Pinch, do you have a death wish? No. Speak only when you're spoken to. Is the answer four? Aura, what did I just say? To speak only when you're spoken to? Exactly. What part of that did you not get? Is it 12? No, the answer was eight. So I was right? Silence! <laughs> Oh my god. All right, so we're gonna need informants. She uh, seems like a very effective Perhaps teacher. Perhaps you can get your little friend uh, to spy for us again. I don't know. She's pretty happy right now, the rest she is. I'll see what I can do, though. Good. Now, we need to come up with a plan. What little friend? I got a plan. Uh, what is it? We just let them come. Give them a couple easy battles, you know? Let them think they're winning. Draw them in closer and closer. That bam! Explosives! Everyone's dead! Confused. Oh my god, okay, stop, stop, stop that. Stop. <laughs> Okay, we're not gonna do that. Something a bit less. Why? Well, it seems like a solid plan. Suffice. Oh, we could um trick them and conjure up the spell to make it look like we have more soldiers. Ah, I don't think that'll work. King Sombra has zombie ponies, and they don't have fear. Bummer. Look, we're fighting a war on two hmm. fronts, which means they can easily divide and conquer us. Now the changelings will have to fight through a few territories before they reach us, which takes time and gives us an opportunity. So, this is what I propose. We send in everything, absolutely everything, at Sombra. Take him out of the picture. With the entire Equestrian army, we can wipe him out with ease. Then, when Sombra is defeated, we send everything back down to the south and fight the war against Christmas. And that's the gist of it. Hmm. Um, Sounds yeah, sure, awesome. okay. Oh, um, what you gonna call it? I'll call it the Schlieffen Pony Plan. What? <laughs>
Yeah, what? <laughs> So that was Scooter Tricks Abridged, episode number 12. Uh, interesting use of the CMC. Military genius, military prodigies. Why not? Uh, so. Yeah, that is uh, an odd episode. Interesting strategy though, focus everything on one point and then go back to the other when they finally reach you. And we'll see how they handle that later, I suppose. Uh, yeah, so I want to thank you all for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed that, but I'm going to end this one here. Until next time, take care. Bye.